Before we get into the video, I need you guys to do me a favour. Number one, get this video to at least 200 likes. Also comment, let me know your thoughts on the case. At 13 years old, what would you expect a teenager's life to be like? Surely, the biggest dilemma would be going to school, bedtime and what to do with your weekend, or picking between COD or GTA. However, not for 13 year old Connor Crow. Connor Crow was only 13 years old when he decided to take the drastic action of erasing his mum and 15 year old sister from his life permanently. I mean, no do others. In September of 2020, Connor Crow, who again was only 13 years old, picked up a pistol, sculpted through his house silently in New Cumberland, which is a small town outside Pittsburgh, Pennsylvania. He then extended his arm when he found his targets steadied his position and then fired several rounds into his mum, 39-year-old Melissa Rowland, and then his sister, 15-year-old Madison. At the time of the tragic incident, again, Connor was only 13 years old and he was dressed in his pyjamas. As his family collapsed to the ground, a pool of red growing bigger, Connor ran outside the family home and started screaming for help. He claimed to anybody that would listen, that someone had fired at his family, a stranger, and also told a neighbour how Connor was able to fire at the made-up stranger as he made a run into the darkness. When police investigated the incident, there was no evidence to suggest that there had been any signs of forced entry or breaking, or any footsteps that didn't belong to anyone in the family. Investigators also found that Connor Crow had residue on his hands, which linked him to the crime in some capacity. Now Connor Crow was ultimately arrested. Now fast forward three years later, Connor Crow, who's now 16 years old, has asked for leniency after finally admitting to the crime. However, a judge sentenced Connor to 40 years for each M. That's 80 years in total. When Connor heard the news, he broke down and shed tears, wiping the tears away with a tissue. Now the worst thing about the entire situation is Connor did not give any reason or motive for why he did something so heinous, so cruel, to his mum and sister. Now it seems like he could have been an opportunist or someone who just wanted his own way and took things way too far. Now I have to mention Connor Crow is eligible for parole after serving 15 years. The main question here is, does the sentence match the crime? Let me know in the comments. Stay safe. Safe.